Hi, this is Rick Eimer with the Palo Alto Weekly. We're here today with Daniel Heimuli, a linebacker with the Menlo Atherton uh, State Champion Bears football team. Uh, he's our athlete of the week this week, and Daniel was uh, really the center of the defense that held this uh, team from Lincoln to seven points, and that was only on uh, one big long play, and then, and then the rest of it they were under control, uh, and they had scored six, 56 points the week before, so I mean that's quite an accomplishment, and all year long your defense has been just tremendous, and uh, I think they only ran for like 14 yards this week against you guys. Kind of just talk about the defense and, and what makes you guys so good. Um, you know, and I'd have to give a shout out to our whole coaching staff uh, together, uh, Coach Drew, Coach Ryan, um, the defensive the defensive coordinator is, is Coach Ryan. Uh, you know, he he drew up things that that uh, that would put us in the best position to be successful. And I think that you know they study the game and they they've been doing everything well this whole season. You know, for the last four years I've been here, they've been doing everything well. Right. And yeah, I know some of the times a, a defense you can't really explain why they're good, but you know it's a combination of you know your defensive line doing their job, the linebackers doing their job, the corner, and then everybody has to do their job and kind of you know. The defensive line in particular, they they kind of clog up things for the linebackers. And uh, what they do is important, obviously. And kind of talk about that a little bit. Um, so, you know, our defensive line is, is I got to say, is one of the best in the peninsula. Um, you know, they op they open things up for me. And, you know, that's why I'm, I'm successful most of the time is because of our defensive linemen. So uh, getting a sack or getting a crunch uh, tackle for a loss, I mean, that that's kind of the exciting things. And, and uh, I mean, those are the things that pump you guys up? Yes, for sure. You know, they put momentum in our team, and being able to do that and to come out with a win is, is great. Now, kind of talk about that state game. It things you got a big crowd in this in the stands are one of the biggest that people remember from way back when. And, uh, you know, things didn't go well right away, but then you kind of started to – get things together and stop the run and went after the quarterback. As, as the game was developing, were you guys thinking, hey, we could actually do this? Yeah, you know, uh, we, we had no doubt after that, after that touchdown that they, that they had on the fourth play. Um, you know, our defense, you know, we're, we're kind of rattled in the first quarter and we, we kind of get it back, get it together during the first quarter. But um, at the same time, we believe in ourselves way a lot, a lot, you know. Uh, we count in each other and we, we, uh, we uh, hold you kind of, hold each other accountable in our jobs and we, we do them very well great and of course you do have other guys Noah's uh, committed to Washington you have a couple of skilled guys that are not even seniors that are getting a lot of offers you yourself have now cut your uh, you know your finals to four or to five excuse me and uh, you know it, that kind of thing too can take its toll but obviously when you're on the field that's somewhere else yeah yeah no you know thinking about the recruiting process is is, uh, is is not on my mind whenever I'm with my team. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm focused on our team and uh, and how we do this season. I'll make sure we uh, could end it with a bang. Now, because you did, uh, I don't know, over the summer you traveled to so many uh, campuses, uh, maybe that helps you put you at ease during for, for this year? Or is that something you did consciously? Um, it, it, you know, I wanted to see all the schools that had offered me a full ride. So... Uh, being able to see that and and cross them out and being um, being able to see what I what, what best fits me really in my family so that that was the best experience ever yeah we, and going with your coach which uh, helped them sure break the ice and for for most of the guys they could do that coach speak you know <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah but how important was it dear to the whole process uh, how how important is coach Dutus? Uh he's very important. Um, you know, if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be. I wouldn't be in the position I am today. Um, but yeah, he's. You know, he's. He every home visit that I've had so far, he's. He's been there with me, and you know, he's been through this whole process with me, and it's been fun. Um, you know, he's. The fact that he he got the word out about me to to other colleges, is um is great, and I I really I appreciate him for everything he he's done. All right, since you won the state championship on uh, Saturday, it's now. Tuesday, uh, what's it been like these last few days? Uh, it's been amazing. You know, it's it's been a dream come true. Um, you know, I'm really sad that the season's over I, and I can't play again with my guys. But um, you know, I'm I'm just proud that we got we got to end with the bang. Right. And I understand there was a uh, yesterday. I think there were the student population got together and did something special for you guys. What, what was that like? Um, getting you know walking down that hall during the parade was it was crazy. Um, you know, it was one of those things that you'll never forget, ever. So, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll take that with me forever, wherever I go. 
That's great. So we've been talking to Daniel Heimuli. He is our Athlete of the Week this week, and congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. And if you want to find out next week's Athlete of the Week, just press that subscribe button down below or visit us at pasportsonline.com.